Hey, Brian here again with another video tutorial on Tinkercad. So today I wanted to show you this great tool called Reflect. So as you may be able to guess, you know that you can select objects and duplicate them as you may want to. And it's very simple and there are multiple ways to do that. So I just achieved that by selecting it and holding Alt and just dragging away. So you can make a copy by holding Alt, clicking and dragging. I can also select it and hit Control C and Control V and that'll just make another copy right there. And you can Control D to make a duplicate and that will keep it in the same exact spot when you make a duplicate. Now, what I'm trying to do in this example here is make a wing to this airplane. Let's just pretend it looks like an airplane and put this wing on the other side of this airplane. Now the way it's shaped, if I just duplicate it, I can't then rotate it and get the same exact effect because the wing will be facing slightly in a different direction. It's flat on this side and angled on the other side. And this side, it's angled here and flat here. So it's not the same effect. Now, if I select this object and I go up here and I choose flip, also could be reflect, but they call it flip in Tinkercad. Click on that and it'll show you the different options you have. You can flip it here, here, or here. Again, this is with the X, Y, and Z axes. So as you hover over one of them, you can see that Tinkercad will give you a preview just like the align tool will. But before I want to flip it, I need to make a copy of it. So if I do choose flip, it can just take that and flip it where it is. But if I want a wing on the other side, first I need to do what I did in the beginning here and duplicate it. So I'm going to hold Alt and Shift and drag it over to the other side and then take that duplicated wing and flip it along this axis here and this way I can have a perfect mirror copy reflection on the other side of the plane. So I hope you found this video useful and helpful and next time you need to duplicate something but it's just not working out rotating it around then consider using the flip tool. Thanks for watching. This has been Brian with Coding Butterfly. Subscribe to our channel and like this video if you enjoyed it and check back in regularly. There will be new videos uploaded at a regular basis. Thanks again and we'll see you soon.